Hello everyone. I want to talk to you today about headhunting. So I get often asked by clients about, you know, it is not ethical to steal people from an organization. Headhunters, recruiters are not ethical people. Um, I want to, again, stop that thought because headhunters cannot take people from organizations that are not willing to leave and don't have reason to leave. So at the end of the day, we don't steal people. We ultimately are trying to give people opportunity. And if there is a person in an organization that has a pain point that is not being solved in that organization, and we come and have a conversation with you about an opportunity that alleviates that pain point, maybe it's that you're traveling too much and you're tired of traveling. And now I come and talk to you about a role that's amazing that limits your travel a little bit. Well, now you're going to perk up your thoughts and you're going to say, I want to be considered for this. Or possibly there's an opportunity where it allows you to have a bit more growth and opportunity for your own career. So now, and you feel stagnant in your current organization. Well, yes, you might perk up your ears and want to hear a bit more about this opportunity. So if everything is amazing and you're happy in your role and your company's doing great and you're feeling fulfilled and you're getting great performance reviews and you you know are doing um, everything right and it feels good then when I make that call to you you're telling me that you're not interested and you might refer me to somebody else so I just again wanted to share because a lot of individuals feel that headhunters are you know stealing their people or that they're you know not ethical in how they do business but at the end of the day you cannot steal somebody who is not interested in making a change. So many of the people that are employed are complacent employees that are not actively looking, but they're not, um, but they're definitely open for change if the right opportunity comes along. And that's all we're doing is going in and talking to those people about the right opportunities that help fulfill their lives. So as an organization, you can look at it as, you know, um, you know, feeling horrible that your employee's leaving, or you can look at it as, you know, I wasn't able to maybe take them to the next level of their career and I want to see them grow and I want to see them flourish and be happy for them to actually do well. And yes, it's a loss for you as an organization, but if you can put it into perspective that now you're gonna bring in somebody new and amazing that's gonna bring and add new value to your company and that last employee is gonna leave and they're gonna take that value that they've had and that they've learned within yours and take it somewhere else and have growth in their own life. Um, I think that's a pretty special thing. So, so it can't all be bad. Sometimes, you know, these things that are challenging are, are actually good for us.